Finally tonight here, remembering singer Ronnie Spector. The night we met, I knew I needed you so. She was the defining voice behind the Ronettes and their hit song, Be My Baby. Ronnie Spector was born Veronica Bennett in Washington Heights, alongside her sister Estelle and cousin Nedra, forming the Ronettes. Their success wasn't immediate. Here's what she told Dick Clark in 1963. Have you made a lot of records? We made two others besides this one, yeah. They have any success? No. <laughs> but with their powerful voices and trademark beehives, the Ronettes would go on to sweep the country with hits for nearly a decade. They would tour with the Rolling Stones in the UK, and it was the Rolling Stones who opened for the Ronettes. It was their collaboration with music producer Phil Spector that brought about some of their most famous songs. Ronnie would marry Spector after the band broke up in 1967. She would later say the magical music we were able to make together was inspired by our love. He was a brilliant producer, but a lousy husband. After years of reported abuse, they would divorce in 1974. Ronnie Spector would launch a solo career. There was Take Me Home Tonight with Eddie Money. The Ronettes were inducted into the Hall of Fame in 2007. Ronnie Spector died after a brief battle with cancer. Her family tonight saying Ronnie lived her life with a twinkle in her eye, a spunky attitude, a wicked sense of humor, and a smile on her face. She was filled with love and gratitude. Celebrating an iconic singer tonight, Ronnie Spector. Good night. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.